So the first deal I did was on this Purell soap. So they only had one, but they were on sale for $2.50. And then I had a 75 cent manufacturer's coupon from coupons.com. And I also had a 75 cent e-coupon from uh, Stop and Shop, the e-coupons. If you have a Stop and Shop, you sign up. Log in to stopashop.com, make an account, and then you can uh, clip your e-coupons and add them to your card. So then there's also a 75 cent Ibotta offer. So this ends up being free and a moneymaker. So the next deal I did was this Arnold, the Arnold bread. So I picked up four breads, uh, four different breads, and these go for $3.99 retail. So these were on sale for buy one get one free and then there was also a promotional offer when you buy three you get five dollar instant savings so after the buy one get one free it rang up for 798 and then with the instant savings comes out to 298 for all four i didn't have any coupons but there was coupons available so then this deal here was spend 15 and get a uh, five dollar instant savings as well so I picked up 12 of the pasta size those are 10 for 10 and then the suave is uh, two for three on sale and these are bigger size better value so um, I had the coupon for a dollar off of two for the suave a manufacturer's principal coupon and then I had an e coupon for a dollar off of two so ended up being a dollar for the two, but then with all of it together, you also get the five dollar discount as well. So I ended up getting seven dollars off of this order here. Okay, so the next deal I did was on this Barilla. Okay, so the Barilla is on sale two for four. The pasta is on sale two for four, and also is these pot like the bigger pastas like this, on um, and the other ones are ten for ten regular pastas. So this uh is the Barilla rigatoni. And then I got two Barilla sauces. So I had a 75 cent off of one principal coupon for the Barilla Rigatoni from a couple of weeks ago that's not available anymore. And where I live, I can double my coupons. So that 75 cent coupon doubles to $1.50. And then I also had a 75 cent e-coupon. So that's already $2.25 off a $2 box of pasta. So that 25 cents will uh, roll over as overage like use towards this so this is two for four i had a dollar off a of two e coupon so that makes it two for three then i had that quarter from here so that makes it 275 for the two and then also ibotta has a rebate when you buy the pasta and a sauce you get a dollar back rebate so this just came out to being super cheap great deal and i'm gonna leave the ibotta link in the description bar and also the coupons.com link where you can print your free coupons that'll all be in the description bar for you guys okay so for my favorite deal so i got 11 arm and hammer laundry detergents and i only paid one dollar and 89 cents guys so they had them on sale for $1.99 each, and then when you spend $20, you're going to instantly save $5. So I also had dollar off of one coupons from coupons.com. So I had 11 coupons, and then I also have $4 in e-coupons. So that was already $14, and then the $5 instant savings. So I only paid $1.89 for all this laundry detergent. Now that's how you do it, ladies. So this is some of the rest of my haul. I did get a couple of other things, but those things didn't really have a coupon with it. They were just on sale. So I just wanted to also point out to you guys, in your local grocery stores, um, check to see if they have like a produce clearance section because my store does. I'm going to insert some pictures for you guys so you can see. And they, I always go there first in the produce section to see what I can find on clearance. <clears throat> so I picked up some of these clearance tomatoes here. And these are $1.55. And you're getting five tomatoes. I also picked up these green apples. 
and these were a dollar seventy three. It just has like a little bruise right there, nothing dramatic. I also picked up these lemon and limes. Lemon and limes are like really expensive now, so this pack was a dollar forty seven, which is a great deal. So then, um, these weren't on clearance, but they were just a good sale for $2.99. So I also always get my bananas. There's usually always bananas on the clearance section. So these were only 43 cents for one, two, three, four bananas. And the reason I like to get them when they're already ripe like this on clearance is because I make banana bread and banana cake, and it's so good. So I also picked up these. For 45 cents and I make banana fritters I love bananas so there's like a bunch of recipes that I can definitely use the right bananas the right bananas for so that's always a good deal when you can get them for like 40 cents and then Ibotta or check out 51 or um what is the other one saving star they usually have some type of rebate towards a fruit or any purchase so you can always get like 25 cents back or something like that so it ends up being like a quarter for all of those so if you guys are interested in any of the recipes that I make with the ripe bananas, let me know in the comments so um, I can go ahead and record that for you guys. So also some more um, clearance produce, some really nice red peppers, and these were $1.19 for the two, and two good green peppers for $1.61. Also found some really ripe avocados. So a pack of four for 92 cents, which is a great deal. And I picked up two of those, the two that they had there. And this was also, this was 94 cents for four. So remember I got my limes and lemons on clearance and I seen the avocado. So I said, hey, might as well pick up some cilantro and make some delicious avocado. Um, I mean, some uh, guacamole. So I love guacamole. We all love guacamole here. So to get it for a dollar for four to make a really nice jar of guacamole is great. And I already have, I did buy a jalapeno and I have my red onions already. So that'll be a nice inexpensive snack to make. Or you can even make it to make with your burritos. And I do make some banging burritos. I have a recipe up. Look for another channel. And I'm going to be making some, uh... Dollar Tree version burritos and trust me you guys are gonna want to see that and try it so so also the last uh, produce I found were these tangerines and these are 97 cents so just a tip always check your produce because I usually always go to the to the discount on um, produce first because you can find some really good produce and you're ripe I don't have no problem with ripe bananas because I need them. And ripe avocados for guacamole is perfect to get them so cheap. And also, um, what else was I going to I was just going to tell you something else. The guacamole, the banana. Oh, so they usually also, what I find a lot of is the ripe plantains. And they'll have them like the ripe bananas on discount. It's like 35 cents for like five of them. And that's what I want. The ripe plantains because they make platano maduro with that. So I'm always looking for those good deals. But for me, it's like, oh, this is perfect actually because I prefer it this way. <laughs> so anyway, um, I also picked up some sodas. They had them three for three dollars. Picked up 10 cans of the Bumblebee. They were 10 for 10. You don't have to buy 10, but I just take advantage because it's a good deal. And I love this tuna and it's the only kind I buy is the solid white albacore. So I also uh, picked up some more pasta sauces. The ragu was on sale for $1.25. So I went ahead and took advantage of that. And there probably is coupons for the ragu. I'm not sure. And I didn't use any because I didn't have any. And there was probably coupons for the sides, the pasta sides that I showed you a little while ago. But again, I didn't have any. But I can live with the price that I got because they were such a good deal. So I just also picked up some uh, corn. These were on sale for 39 cents. And then um, I picked up some meat. So first of all, I picked up this ground beef and it's on sale for $2.99 a pound. It's usually $3.49 a pound. So I got it for $8.85, which is a good deal right there already. Also, 
uh, Ibotta has a rebate right now. It was 50 cents on any ground beef purchase, so I'll get 50 cents back on Ibotta for that. And then I also picked up a pack of chicken for $5.68 and a big pack of stew meat for $4.49 a pound, regularly $5.49. So it's a dollar off a pound, which is good. So I ended up paying $13.51 versus $16.52. And the reason this is even better is because on my e-coupons, I had a spend, 50, spend $25 on meat and get $10 off uh, coupon. So I got $10 off of this 50, uh, $25 purchase. So it's basically like I got this pack of meat for free and got a couple dollars off of one of those other packs. On top of the 50 cent, I bought a rebate. So that was a great deal to uh, get some meat. And then also I had a e-coupon for four dollars off of a forty dollar order so that was also applied so that was another four dollars off plus all my coupons that i had already and also i had a coupon for a free reusable stop and shop bag these go for 99 cents so i got that for free as well and then i will be getting um some i bought rebates back about three about three to four dollars and i bought a rebates and that was it guys so um let me tell you guys so my total with everything that i bought was 216 dollars and 16 cents before coupons and savings so after my coupons and savings i only paid 96 dollars and 55 cents for 216 dollars worth of groceries so that was a total savings of $119.61, guys. I mean, come on. And I didn't even really use much coupons. The most coupons I had was really for the detergent. And the other coupons, I basically had double coupons. So it was like the main fresh coupon and then the e-coupon. Plus, I bought a rebate. And the rest were just shopping sales and discounts. And usually, you know, you would want to use a coupon if it's available. But like I said, I didn't have any um any coupons for it so for some items which are probably are available but that's okay i still killed it so if you guys have any questions go ahead and leave them in the comments and go ahead and give me that thumbs up if you like these type of coupon videos and you want to see more and if you're new be sure to hit that subscribe button and i'll catch you all in the next one peace out